Hey, Charlie. Great to see you're out working on your swing. Love getting this video of you. Um, I want to see if I can offer some uh, tips uh, just to kind of help uh, you take that next step. You know, you're looking good out there. I think there's a lot of good things going on. I just want to offer a quick tip to you, something you can really work on over the next few weeks uh, when you're out on the tee or soft toss or whenever it is, whenever it is you're working. My tip is about your starting position. One thing I'm noticing here with your swings is this back elbow is, start, is as you start to initiate your swing is in a very low position. What we want to see, Charlie, is before you start to swing, your elbow needs to come up into there before it initiates the swing and rotates through into the position you want to get in. You're, you're starting your 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 swing with these elbows very low, which is creates kind of a sweeping drag. Instead of what we really want, Charlie, is more of a snap and a cross as you rotate your hips. So I'm going to let this play through in slow motion, and we're going to watch a couple, couple of your swings here. And I'm sure you're able to make good contact there, it looks like. But again, I want to stop there. So, so Charlie, as you're initiating your swing again, if you look at this elbow, um, it's creating a back drag. Your elbow should be up higher in again into this area up here before it rotates through the swing because what we don't want to have happen is called bat drag and i think that's that is exactly what's happening here and if you look even closer as we're able to stop this elbow is leading the swing when that's the opposite of 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 what it should be doing the elbow should not lead your swing as it does here and you'll be able to correct that by getting that elbow up, so uh, and then snapping it th through into the zone, kind of following with your hips. We're gonna watch one more time here on this third swing, and again, as you get a little tired, look how low the elbow is there, and you're just gonna sweep that bat across. So I want you to work on that when you go outside, just to 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 kind of help you lose that bat drag. A lot of good stuff going on with your balance there. You're really hitting off your back leg. It's some positive stuff. I just wanted to focus this video on that on that one little correction. We don't want to drag the bat across, and we're going to be able to do that by getting that that starting position as you begin your swing, getting that back elbow up. Hope you uh, enjoy the video. I hope that helps. Thanks.